Welcome to the Nerdy Fitness Vlog with Pablo Gunner. I'm here to talk about nerdy fitness stuff and nerdy stuff and fitness stuff. So, over the weekend there was something peculiar that happened, which is, well not peculiar, but kind of peculiar. Okay, so I was broke because I paid the mortgage and I'm an adult and that's what adults do is they pay their bills and then they're broke. So that's what I did and that's what happened. So I was broke. So usually the wife and I, we go out and we eat out on our day off together, days off together. That's what we do. Unfortunately, we were broke. But earlier in the week, my wife had bought a quiche from Costco and she wasn't eating it. She specifically bought it for work. She did not take it to work. And so I was losing my crap, but it was also partially because her mom made her food. She's like, you don't make me food. And I was like, I would make you food, but you don't eat the food I make you because it's too healthy. Okay. So anyways, which is funny because even the food that her mom made her, she hasn't been taking to work, which is why I took it to work because it's healthy. So anyways, so what happened is, I was like, all right, wife, well, this, we do not waste in this house. As the gunner mantra goes, the gunner house motto goes, we do not waste in this house. So I was like, I'm eating this quiche. Even if I don't like it, I'm eating this quiche. It was actually two different quiches. One of them is cheese and broccoli. And, uh, and then the other one's like spinach. I want to say it's spinach. It looks like spinach and artichoke dip. Which I might let that one go to waste, cause I. Uh, but I'll, I'll still, I'll still cook it and try it. And if I hate it, then I'm not gonna eat it. I'll just make her eat it. Eat it. But anyways, so I made the cheese and broccoli one. Now I wasn't really sure what quiche is. I don't think she really is really sure what quiche is either. So she got it, and that's I think that's partially why she wasn't taking it to work to eat, cause she was like. Ah, so you do have to cook it in the oven. So there's that. But what it is, it's kind of like a, not pie crust, but like bread. There's like a breading crust on the bottom. And then what it's actually like egg. It's kind of like if you were to just make an omelet, but you threw in like broccoli and cheese in there. And then you, but you threw it on top of like, um, like a pie crust, but it's not sweet. It's, it's, you know. And that's what it is, and that's what, you know, it didn't take that long. Like I said, the wife got it from Costco, came with two, threw it in there. It wasn't cooked enough, like the bottom wasn't cooked enough at first, so I threw it in there for longer, and uh, and then it was a little bit better. But it was good, it was pretty, it was tasted pretty good, and uh, that's all I had all weekend was that, pretty much. And actually, I did have some mochi, uh, some mango, it was like ice cream, mochi there was mango and there's strawberry the wife and I had uh, some of those but that it was one of those things where it was like I only ate when I was hungry and so it worked out perfectly like by the end of the weekend like I was looking chiseled because I only ate what I needed what my body needed I only ate when I was actually hungry so it worked out pretty well I also watched a lot of I watched a lot of television because I did a lot of laundry. I did my wife's laundry, I did my laundry, so I watched a lot of TV. So I watched Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I finished Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. I was like halfway through the season already, but it's a long season. And uh, so I watched that and it was like, it was good. Like all the, the robot stuff was really good. And I thought that was gonna be the main basis of the rest of the season and it wasn't. And it was for, it was like one episode. It lasted one episode. And then after that one episode, it was just, they get put into this AI world that seems completely world, but it's twisted. And then I was like, I really don't care about this because it's not real. Like, can we just be in the real world? Like, so that really bugged me. There's interesting aspects, but it was messed up. So I was still like, all right. And then the, but the finale was freaking awesome because of course you had, Ghost Rider make a return. Uh, it was, I thought it was gonna be predictable, but it wasn't. So that's good that it wasn't like 
predictable, like, oh yeah, Ghost Rider's gonna just show up and he's just gonna fix everything out of nowhere in the last episode, and that wasn't the case, so, not exactly, so yeah, it was, it was, it was solid. I also watched Castlevania, but Castlevania was so short, which I hear the people that made Castlevania are, like, the same writers that did Witcher, so, I, I'm thinking about just going, F it, I'm not gonna play Witcher 2, I'm just gonna play Witcher 3, because everyone says that game is so great. There's so many cosplayers and there's so many people and there's just like not that cosplayers aren't people but you know anyways so yeah uh so yeah that's that's what i did but i came into work early last night and so i did i was like all right well i want to do hardcore car or i want to do hardcore cardio but i also want to do yoga so i met it was a mishmash of my hardcore cardio workout and my x my x training and then my uh cape shape cardio I, I mashed them up together pretty much and I did yoga and then I did the cape shape cardio which is the hardcore uh, cardio stuff and I even threw in burpees in there but I hate the name of burpees and I don't know why they're called burpees I, so, I, so I changed the name of them to Batman v Superman's because you, you do a push up and then you jump up into the air like Superman so it's like we all know Superman don't work out but Batman does that's why he's like the peak of you know human excellence in every way and then Superman's just born that way uh, so more or less so yeah um, so I didn't get to finish my workout completely because I was like I ran out of time there was like three or four workouts that I didn't get to do which is unfortunate but I ran out of time because I had to shower and get ready for um, and I wasn't, I was surprised because I thought I was going to be really hungry after I got off or after I was done with my workout and I wasn't. So, but I was a little hungry. So I was like, all right, once I got situated and stuff, I was like, ah, I'll just have a cheese stick to stave me off. Cheese stick, that was good. I was good for a couple hours. And then I had, and then I had the chicken. I had a chicken thigh, um, about six ounces of mashed potatoes and a small corn on the cob. And that filled me up. I was good to go the rest of the night. Uh, but around like 6.30, I was like, you know what? Maybe I should eat because I have my, I'm going to do my arms workout this morning after I get off. So once I knew I was going to get off work, I was like, all right, I'm going to eat this oatmeal cup that the wife got me. Where it's like, uh, you know, you just fill up water to the line and then you warm it up for like 50, 55 seconds. And it's, uh, it was cranberry and almond thrown in there. So I love cranberry, so it was fantastic. So I had that. Like I said, I was done around like 6.30 or whatever eating that. So it worked out really well because I was like, oh, yeah, I'll be getting off around like, I'll be able to work out probably around 8.30. So that's two hours later. So that'll work perfect. So I had plenty of energy because I was new. Hey, if I don't eat, because I've made this mistake many, 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 many times, if I don't eat, I'm going to be starving and then I won't have the energy to go work out and do the second workout. I was like, nope, I'm, I'm doing it this time. So that's what I did, stuck to it. Did the arms workout, solid workout. But it's not enough. I need to add more. So I need suggestions for more workouts. And here's the thing is, I, I do sets, but my sets are like this. One chest, one chest workout, one bicep workout, one tricep workout, one forearm workout, one shoulder workout, yeah, and that's how, I, and then I repeat that with different, so it's a different workout, but it's that same, those same categories every time, so if you have suggestions, send them my way, if you have any suggestions actually for any workouts at all, cardio, whatever, especially if they're nerdy themed, send them my way, and I'll throw them into the workout, and, uh, and see how I like them. So yeah, so but uh, yeah, fantastic. I, even now I'm like I'm not really that hungry, so uh, so I'm good. So anyways, that's it for now. So thank you for watching. Stay fit, stay healthy, and stay nerdy. Love and peace.